this is gonna be like one of these longer videos when I talk. I haven't done these ones in ages right now. <laughs> and I just want to like give quick life update and if you want to hear the college part, just... <laughs> I'm doing this YouTuber thing, just skip to this timeline. I haven't been uploading for like three days now because I, I basically run out of content for, for now. And it's like, even before I wasn't like thinking about doing it, like not doing YouTube or content uh, anymore, but like, <laughs> I just, I didn't had like literally like any idea what to do. And so like, I thought that last break I took was in like <laughs> November, maybe when I was going to job, but we're like, <laughs> we are in March right now. And I don't know if I should take a break like for a week or two, maybe no, like not like for a week, but like I'm thinking about it because <laughs> I literally don't have like anything to like talk about. And I started reading a book like <coughs> here. <laughs> This is like Polish book and like, I don't know if you can get it in UK or America, wherever you are, but like, <laughs> I started reading it. It seems cool. And I'm, I'm, I will try to finish it. I also started playing a lot of Ghost of Tsushima because like, it, I saw that it's gonna be on PC in a while in May. And like, <laughs> I, at first I was thinking like, <laughs> I just wait till May, you know, and I buy it. But then I was like, hey, my friend has PS4. I, I'll just borrow it for a while and play it. So I borrowed it and I'm playing Ghost of Tsushima right now. And like Bloodborne is next. But at the same time, as I said, I I don't have ideas for content anymore. <laughs> and, and I don't feel burnt out because I would love to edit for you something, but like <laughs> I don't know what college stuff so if you're here for the college stuff <laughs> this one is for you my personal advice for you is to like take a year off of school like entirely just take your head off somewhere else N not to like you know party and drink or something but just like <laughs> take your brain off school for like a year because some new ideas might pop up some new opportunities might pop up and you won't be able to take them because like you're in school, you know, <laughs> and like, as I said, take a one year off, uh, maybe two if you need to, like if you're young, maybe, maybe go in your twenties rather than just <laughs> pushing it to your, when you're 19 and then just go for it because like the entire culture of like uh, college is, is stupid. Don't go to college. It's like people who are trying to make you like escape the matrix is like they're making another matrix for you where here you live in like <laughs> our world well it's like go to school go to sc college and like then do actually whatever you want because <laughs> honestly like you don't have to go to job you don't have to work like you can become bum whenever you actually want. You can just <laughs> pay like gym fee, like, I don't know, $50 monthly and just basically live there. You have showers, you probably have where to sleep, like <laughs> just live for the rest of your life for $50 a month or even less, whatever. But like, <laughs> that, that's, that's not the point. Mm. But there is this other side of matrix where you are like, oh, don't go to college, make your business. And like, okay, I'm going to start a business. What fucking business? You don't even, you don't even have an idea. Like, oh, let me try dropshipping. Let me try copywriting. Let me try X business that is popular right now. And it's, it won't work probably like small percentage of people actually like make it out but like 
<laughs> if you like those odds, try it. Whatever. But at the same time, it's like it's path less traveled. But at the same time, it's like when you don't go to college and you take this risky path, it's like you're setting yourself for even more failure than when you take the matrix path. When you don't go to college and if you have like if you have like rich parents or something and they can like let you go on daily studies rather than just making it on weekend and working a full day or something. And if you like have rich parents or something, then it's like it will be much easier for you to just go to college and buy yourself like three, maybe four years more. Because then you will be able to figure out what you actually want to do or actually develop this business you were thinking about. Because like if you go this path and it's like, oh, uh, business, business, hustle, hustle. And like what, where, how? You have all these gurus telling you what to do and it's like <laughs> they're basically telling you what they did and it worked for them. It won't work for you. Life doesn't work that way where you actually have like one size fits them all. Like if you if you do the same fucking shit as Hamza or <laughs> maybe as Andrew Tate, whatever, it won't work for you probably. Like maybe for this one percent that went to the gym where they didn't have to, it probably won't work for you. Because like, I'm not saying that you shouldn't try it, because you should actually. <laughs> you know, we are probably young. <laughs> uh, I saw that <laughs> small percentage of my audience is like 60 years old. <laughs> probably it's just some kid playing with the date, whatever. <laughs> there, there is no possibility that someone older than 25 is watching my video. <laughs> there is like very small percentage for you to success and as i said i'm not encouraging you to drop it but like think about what you actually want to do because if you are like i don't know drop shipping just for money not because you're some like passionate about the product or something you're just doing it for money it might work out because a lot of people do it for money it might work out but at the same time it's like it won't probably because either you don't even have any experience you're listening to someone that worked for him that doesn't mean that it will work for you go to college figure out, out life there you, you probably meet some new cool people you make some connections like hustle culture says you make connections and you're like okay where should I just go up to the strongest guy in the gym and like, hey, uh, do, do, do you have some business in money? You know, you, you, you make cash and all, and can I join? No, like <laughs> you could do that, and, but they probably be like, scram, kid. We, we are basically like too young to do such things. We're like too immature to do these things. And I don't know if you noticed, because it's like, <laughs> I, I don't want to be like superstitious or something, but like most majority of these gurus that tell you to not go to college, they finished college and they have a degree and they maybe tell you that it's worthless or something. But guess what? If it wasn't for college, they probably won't be gurus. They probably wouldn't be gurus. And guess what? It buys you a lot of time, especially when you are older. Because like, if you're like 14, four years won't make a difference. Because like, you're still in school probably, and you won't develop like adult-like characteristics. But when you're like 20, 21, you're like, your brain is developed in different way. And you think differently. And when it buys you a lot of time, you will actually think about solutions rather than just like a 14, 13 year old, like, oh, I'll make money so I can buy new Jordans and pick up Jessica from school. Like you're thinking in a larger scale, you're thinking in a different kind of way. And it's like very important for you. 
because like if you if you are like 20 21 maybe even further whatever and you like work your entire day and you go back from work and you like tired and you think like oh i should push through i should like be better and all but uh, i should work out even though i'm tired and like it will give you like benefits like mentally like yeah i'm very disciplined and all but at the same time you will your progress will be much slower than someone who went to college and like don't call people stupid for going there because they might have their own agenda under it like they go to college to buy themselves time and they will be like further in life at 24 25 than you who went this way to like build business and all think about it as like i, I don't know a 10 year plan like think about where you will be when you're 30 someone who went this path they will have money right and all but they outside of their business they will have basically nothing and here you have degree if business doesn't pan out here you you, you have job from your degree probably <laughs> like if, if you made like whatever you know you know what i mean like you have job right you can just like pay off the debt if you have you can like just sa save some money and and open another one and for them like they are basically broke even if they have business like okay they make like 50k a month or something but if they like buy some random shit and don't invest don't save they will quickly lose it and then they will have like okay i have the knowledge to start another business in this field and they're like try 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 and maybe it will pan out again here is of course it's very safe road like that's obvious actually you know that that's very obvious you pay three years to have a degree and be safer for your entire life because that doesn't mean like if you go to college you are basically you are basically nine to five rat or something it doesn't mean that and like young people from this side are trying like yeah oh I, i'm 14 years old and if i don't start business soon enough i will become nine to five rat and you know rat race working till you're 65 it doesn't work that way it's all up to you actually you don't <laughs> as i said at the beginning you don't actually have to fucking work you can just i don't know become a bum and not becoming a bum doesn't actually mean that you, you you get starter pack you know like alcoholism like nicotine addiction or something no you just become homeless and you can do whatever you want from there and i'm not saying that being homeless is fun you know actually it, it would be peaceful like if you just <laughs> w washed yourself and went for like a long journey to some like i don't know warm country or something and become bummed dirt and it's like you know sleep under stars well uh, like <laughs> you have entire free day it would be chilly actually <laughs> maybe becoming a bum is actually cool no mm. <laughs> like going to college doesn't set you for failure and like going to through the hustle culture doesn't set you for failure either don't don't embrace either one because like don't embrace the college as like your like your entire personality and don't embrace hustle culture as your entire personality because it's like once you once you are like too far gone in either of the three it's like you're too far gone so as i said don't embrace either way and to finish this video i want to say like make a lot of money but money is not everything but you you actually have to make a lot of money to find out that it's not nothing because like we are actually like you know <laughs> brokies and something but like we actually care about money 
And people who don't care about money are basically like millionaires. And people who don't care about looks are basically like, you know, 10 out of 10 faces or something. And like, honestly, you can't tell people like money is not everything, but you need it. Actually, it's like a lie. <laughs> like money is not everything is a lie. Trust me, money would solve like 99 problems of like, I don't know, world. Don't say that money is not everything because like you can say it once you actually have the money. That's that's how I think. Because like when you say money is not everything but you don't have them and you're like struggling and like oh my life is sad or something. Because if your life is sad and you say money is not everything then <laughs> of course I'm not gonna listen to you. But yeah. If you're like afraid to apply to college or something, I encourage you to go there. Just like go, check it out, buy yourself like a year maybe too. Just just figure the life out. Because you know, we, we're young, like we're actually too young to you know spend time hustling and we are too young to waste this time. So like find the middle. F go from there. Like don't think about like Oh yeah, I should have laid out 10 year plan because as I said in the beginning, new opportunities might pop up, new ideas might come to your head. And like, don't set up 10 year plan with your 20 year old thinking. Just figure out what you want to do on the go. Because like when you're 23, you will think differently. When you're 25, you will think differently. When you're 25, you will think about, oh yeah, I have a degree, but now I want to try something else. And <laughs> in your 20 year old, 10 year plan, it wasn't there. Like you thought like, oh yeah, I'm gonna just pass college, work, hustle, make a factum of money. <laughs> That's probably like your plan. <laughs> and it's not gonna work because as I said, you're 25 year old, 28, and you're like, I don't want to do this anymore. I want to try something else. So go to college to buy yourself time. Just be like older rather than just clinging to your youth. Because like <laughs> I honestly wanted, always wanted to be like older. Like everyone was saying like, oh no, you're so young. You shouldn't say that. And like, I always want to be older because like then I would like, be able to do things like I can just leave my home right now and just apply to like to make a license for car or like I, I just I, I could just go and I don't know just drink or something you have like so much freedom and opportunities when you're like older when you're like 15 16 and you're thinking like oh hustle culture it's like so hard for you to actually like do these things because of the law, because of the, like everything else. Even parents will like intervene with with it. But like when you're when you're older, you understand more things, and you will actually understand what you actually want from life. 